What's up everybody, this is Robert with Trolling in Paradise and I'm back with another album review. Today I'm reviewing the new album by Enslaved with their album Heimdall. This comes out on, came out March 3rd on Nuclear Blast Records. I'm gonna go over who Enslaved are and then I'm gonna go over the album. Enslaved is a Norwegian progressive black metal, Viking metal band from Norway. They were formed by Ivar Bjornsson and Grutto Jelsen when they were uh, teenagers, and those two guys are the sole original members. And the current lab is those two guys, along with Arve Eistel Isdel on guitar, Hakon Vinste on keyboards, and uh, this is this new album second with Ivor Sandoy on drums, who joined in 2018. And uh, Ivor, the Sandoy's first album with them was uh, Utgard in 2020. Anyway, I'm going to go over the album now. Heimdall is the 16th studio album from Enslaved, named after a character in Norse mythology. And... They did an EP in 2021 called Caravans to the Outer Worlds, which obviously the kind of a cool thing because they actually have a song on this album called Caravans to the Outer Worlds, which I'm going to get to in a little bit here. And this one has some progressive rock elements in there too. And this one received some positive reviews. Uh, Throw some metal jam and John gave it uh, five stars. So this would probably this might be his number one album of 2023. And the Crack gave it four and a half stars. So pretty high up there for the year end list. And it's an obvious album of the year contender for a lot of people. So yeah, this one this one might be my album of the year. So I'm gonna go over the track listing. There are seven songs. Uh, first song is Behind the Mirror, that, uh, this one is, uh, this one's really cool, and I imagine they might play that one this spring on tour, which I'm going to be seeing them April 18th with Insomnium and Black Anvil. Up next, Congelia, this was the first single, this was released back in November. And this one just brings in the black metal sound, especially some of these uh, Viking themed elements in there. Next is Force Dweller. This was the uh, most recent single released. Obviously, this one, I feel like this kind of sounds a bit like Legend of Zelda because of the, uh, because of. Uh, uh, gives me like a Breath of the Wild vibe because of the uh, vocal blends invading the fort, walk, uh, dwelling in the forest, and I and Link having to kill them with uh, arrows and or sometimes a sword. Kingdom is the shortest song in the album. Another track that gives me like a Legend of Zelda vibe because you know Hyrule and among other things like Oscard with the Viking mythology with Oscard, that sort of thing. The Eternal Sea, obviously, that one sounds a bit like, uh, that one sounds very pirate-like uh, in terms of a theme, especially about, especially themes like, theme like that, but this one's definitely Viking themed, sailing out across the ocean to different Lands to settle. Caravans to the Outer Worlds. This was the name of an EP they dropped in 2021. And this was also released as a single. And this looks like this kind of, to me, it sounds like uh, uh, heading to the. Uh, Sounds like a Legend of Zelda mission, like heading ending up in the Dark World and Link to the Past in a way. And the last song is the title track, Heimdall. 
Uh, this is a really awesome closer. And uh, this one definitely based on Norse mythology, especially because of their theme being Vikings and stuff. Anyway, all, the, all in all, this is a really fun album. I have heard that Enslaved does not have a bad album. Well, their 2008 album is kind of a clunker, but not that the group has a bad album per se, but it's really good. I'm going to give it 9 out of 10. It's an amazing album. Anyway, that'll be it for this video. I'll see you next time.